Hi everyone, it's me, Violet. And Katya. And you're watching another episode of RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review. Hi, all of my pretty hot and tasties. It's Eureka here, all the way from season nine and 10 of RuPaul's Drag Race. And we are doing New York City Drag Con September 28th, 29th, and 30th. Make sure you get your tickets at RuPaul'sDragCon.com and come see the Elephant Queen. What are you gonna be? You look great. You look really good. <laughs> <laughs> you girls look good. good. You look good. You guys look good. This is my mother of dragoons look. What are, what, I don't what, watch It's all okay, that. my Shangela. What are we tooting and booting today? We are gonna be tooting and booting the looks from the red carpet of the AVN Awards. That's adult film stars, porno peoples. People who do sexy sex. movies, sex do workers. Sex on camera. Yes, we've all been there. I haven't personally been there, but I've seen. Girl, you showed me your. No, 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 no that doesn't. We've count all done. <laughs> uh, the Avian Awards are just like the Oscars for porn peoples. And honestly, I think that these people might actually turn fiercer looks than like your average celebrity. Yeah, because these people are like superheroes, especially when it comes to the mucosa of their genitalia. Well, it also takes a really strong bitch to like be super vulnerable like that on camera, you know? Kind of like what we do. Yeah, it also, it takes a strong bitch to get and then like by 1400 dinglings. And I am that strong bitch. That's so her. let me know. That's her. I conk out after three, <laughs> so. So first up, we've got Vicky Chase. She looks gorgeous. She looks great. She looks good. But I, I love this little bitty little necklace. Like I love these little yeah. accessories. Oh, V for Vicky. Oh, get, get it. it. Yeah. I think she looks great. I don't know who designed the dress. It looks amazing. Maybe it's like a Michael Costello situation. R Roberto Cavalli. A scenario, yeah. you know. We love, we love the cleavage. We love the high slit. I like her strappy shoe. We like yeah. an, a woman carries a bag. Yeah. It's a I mean, it's train. A, yeah. We love. Long train. And it's, um, it looks like maybe satin and there's no wrinkles. It's definitely not a, well, maybe it is satin. It's lined. Did you know that satin sheets are very romantic? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't. Well, now you do. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Total two. Good job, Vicky. Next up, Dark up and Stormy Daniels. Next. She's I'm gonna say right off the bat, boot. Okay. Okay. All immediate, right. I mean, immediately to me, it's a it's a boot. And I'll tell you why. Tell you, you, I, go no, no, no. you go ahead. <laughs> well, I, I've seen this fabric a lot. That's no, what I was gonna say, yeah. <laughs> This fucking fabric has made the rounds. I swear to I've, God. I know. I, I've seen this fabric on probably every drag and queen in every mannequin in every garment district yeah. in every city ever. Yeah, it's about just it's because like eight dollars a yard. Pre sequin fabrics, a look does not make. Just because it's shiny doesn't mean it's good. That's a great and a like great I think people get sequins and good confused. They're not they don't they don't equal each other. And this fabric is so tired and played out, and that's why it's a fing boot. Her <laughs> and also her I hair just looks kind of like pearl. It looks all like those a, layers, like it's not 2006 anymore. It looks like a wig that I would wear. It looks like a wig that Lindsay Lohan wore in 2007. Yeah. I wish she was wearing like a Heart of the Ocean necklace. I yeah. just think it's really bad. No substance. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, wow. I just hate pre-sequin fabric. Like, oh, all right, we get it, we get it. I really hate, this is like a PSA, this is my chance. She hand glues all of her sequins no. to her dresses. Glues. <laughs> 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 just Elmer's. <laughs> um, yeah, it's I a mean, boot. It's boot. Honestly, this fabric is so yeah. unfree, like th there's no excuse. We are moving on to Mia Isabella. This and is delightfully tacky. <laughs> Honestly, what what gives it to me is that she's selling the fuck out of it. <laughs> she's like, selling the garment. This is how you sell yeah. a red carpet. This fur? This is how oh. you do it. Yeah. This top knot? Yeah. Me? Wait, me? The AVN Awards? Oh, I guess I could. This is what I needed. You know, this is yeah. what I want on a red carpet. I want you to give me... That is a very... This well, is my moment. I'm here at my award show. Yeah, but I gotta, t I gotta say... The legs... You know she's uncomfortable, girl. But that is an awkward length for a gown. I wouldn't really call this a gown. <laughs> wait, would wait, you call this you, a gown? What would you call it? I would call, I mean, a, 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 look, she's selling the fuck out of it. Okay. But this is some Santee Alley stretch cocktail dress bottle service bullshit. It's like a hustler getup, kind of. It's just not the fantasy. It doesn't fit right. It's 
puckering in weird ways, like, may, I don't know, it, the slit. It takes a lot of cojones to wear brown velveteen. Do you like the shoe? I hate the shoe. It's awful. She's amazing. I, Mia, you look fucking gorgeous. Yeah. You're selling the fuck out of it. But the dress is a boot. Yeah, it's a boot. So we are moving right along to Kendra Sutherland. Initial reaction. <sighs> I well, like it. Well, it's just basic. Yeah, but she looks, I mean, she, she looks beautiful. Is, no, she looks basic. Okay. I think she looks a little bit, I mean, like, even in the face, like, it's, like, demure. Yeah. It looks like she's going to the prom. Although, it, is it, it, is it too much? It does look like she's going to the prom. Now, I have a question for you. Is it scandalous to show that much leg at a prom, like a high school prom? No. It's not? No. Really? Not now. Oh, Not okay. these days, right? Okay. I would go in a sheer dress to prom. Now, I would go like full on panties. Rose McGowan on the red carpet. Like, no panties. No bra, no panties. No panties. Panties, bitch. None. No bra, no panties. No bra, no panties. Yeah, I mean, it's either here nor there. For me, it seems like a dress, again, you would get downtown yeah. for prom or like. Off the rack. It's an off the rack situation. But I mean, I guess the AVN, they're not getting dressed by Oscar Dio. You could still get a custom dress. We get custom dresses made all the time. That's true. You could still do a little razzle dazzle, a little shimmy. Yeah. Um, she looks good. She doesn't look bad. It's kind of boring. I mean, it's like, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to boot it. Um, yeah, sure, a boot. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it's she's not really giving me like it's like glam. It's like diet glamour. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like it's like if you're gonna give me the glam silhouette, the glam dress, like give me the glamour. Like or I need. Or give me right. Or give me something out of left or field, like a football else. helmet. Yeah, like put a football helmet on something, it. Something, girl. Yeah. Okay. All right, Genevieve Hex. I... Initial reaction. Yes. Yes. This is great. Honestly, I think this is great. I love it. I do too. I love it. Yeah. What I love most is the pose yeah. and the sheer, po I mean, it's all really good. It's, it's all, all really fabulous. good. You're gonna spend all that time and money getting tattoos on your legs. You're gonna you show, show them, yeah. Them. yeah. Well, um, almost like a pentagram. I mean, she's like, and even the name Hex, like I like, it's like on brand for her. Like I don't even yeah. have to watch her, her movies or know who she is to know that she's like, some twisted, demonic, sexy, bad girl. And yeah. I always live for that girl. Yeah, she probably sounds guys within the decor. Yeah, there's probably some sort of like, yeah, like mm. electrocution. Maybe she's like in a Harry Potter porn, but in with, with the wand, they're putting it in the in the, the dingling hole. You've seen that one, huh? What do you think about these sheer bedroom pants? I love the pants because there's like a trim at the bottom. Yeah. She's got a, a good platform stripper shoe on. Yeah. The panties, it gives me like, you know when Christina Aguilera was in the like early 2000s, the uh -huh. naughties, the naughties? The oddies. The oddies. The naughties. The naughties? I thought it was the naughties. Or the aughts. The aughts. You'd say the early aughts. The early 2000s when it was like, I'm gonna be a bad girl. Yeah. It like, gives me very that, which I love. I think that's making a comeback. And obviously the corset, the fetish element, I live for. And I think it's just kind of refreshing to have someone who's like on brand, unashamed, living their truth, living their journey, blah, blah, blah. blah sheer bell-bottom pants on the yeah. red carpet. I think it's really fun. I give it a toot. Toot. All right, up next we've got Gina Valentina. Gina. Hello, it's me. Gina Valentina. Gina Valentina. I like this. I love to hate it. It's, okay. I hate to love it. It's polarizing. It's polarizing. A, it's a, it's a, it's it's polarizing. This is it's, polarizing yeah. as This is very polarizing. It's very controversial. No, it's just polarizing. <laughs> what do you, what, what? it's, it's polarizing. Because like, I love it, but it's also awful. Which is great. Honestly, yeah. that's like the best thing you could possibly be. I would say a special thanks the hair is to bad. the um, well to the bikini waxer because Sweetie, that that snatch is snatched. Yeah, that mound is is cleared <laughs> for takeoff. <laughs> she has mowed the grass. Um, I don't know if I would ever combine like a marabou train. Yeah. With shibari. Oh, shibari. the train is just like plopped over it. Yeah, I don't. Okay. For me, marabou and rope don't go together, but. Whatever, I mean. What about all the dingles hanging down? What is that all about? Honestly, I wish the whole marabou thing and the dingle dangles would be gone. Yeah. And she had like a bomb bag. Yeah. If she just had like a fucking clutch and a little like rope outfit, like that would be more sickening to me than like. Yeah. A sh it's like giving me like a showgirl scenario, but it's not. Uh, you know what I would do? I would ditch the marabou and then I would just do like, um, if you could get like uh, thigh high rope booties, boots, Ugh. or like, um, 
or maybe, like, or just like hot glue some rope to some pleasers. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, but like t do like knots in the yeah, front. Oh. That'd be amazing. Toot. Toot. Polarizing toot. Polarizing toot. Yeah. Bridget B coming at you. I think it's pronounced Brigitte. I don't think so. Or is it Bridget? I, I think it's probably just Bridget. <laughs> <laughs> this is a lot of look. Toot. Yeah. Toot. Toot. Oh toot, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought it was for a minute there. I thought it was like pants, but then no, 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 no. no, no. no. Uh, it's a two for me because it's um, yellow, and it's uh, streamlined, and it's um, it fits nicely. And there's a, the accessories are subtle yet tasteful. Love. And the hair is beachy. Mm. Um, that's where you lose me. Oh, you don't like the hair? The hair. Oh. That's my one critique. Yeah, I guess the hair is a little The hair is casual. lackluster. Well, it's just, it's you can tell. casual. Bitch, if she would have given me like the Marcel wave, oh. I know it's tired and played out. Mm. Like I want to see Jessica Rabbit. Like one eye covered. Oh yeah. Oh. I love it. I think the dress is like very Herve Leger, like mm -hmm. super, super tight, slinky yeah. um, bandage. I love that. No panty lines. No panty lines. No panties. No bra. No, no panties. panties. <laughs> no bra. No panties. No bra. No, no panties. panties. The jewelry is glamorous. The dress is glamorous. She's obviously glamorous. Big lips, big t I mean, what's not to love? She looks great. The dress fits her really well. I like the plunging. I just think, I wish the hair was like done. Yeah. And I think you can tell that it's extensions, which I think is like fine. Oh, but like, you totally. You know what I mean? Yeah, the extensions are very apparent. And if she had a hairdresser do this for her, you need to fire them. I mean, the hair's not working for me. This hair's working for me. The hair works. I mean, get a full frontal, sweets. Come on, toots. Tootsie. I bet she's done a few full frontals in her career. <laughs> <laughs> you know, because it's porn. Oh you know what I mean. Um, I think it's a two. Bridget B, you got a fucking toot for me, bitch. Toots. Trend, Trend alert. alert. Exposed legs. Skin below S the belt. Sultry, leggy. High slit. Goddesses. Sheer pant. What's on the menu? Legs. <laughs> <laughs> Our, Our top, top two of the week, week is Genevieve, Genevieve Hex. Hex. Freshly tatted and probably scatted. On brand, fetish, gothy. Yeah. Bustier. Bustier. We um, love. Palazzo, Lurex, trim. Lurex, pant. Yeah. Tattooed. Diva. Underarm. Sultry, sexy diva. diva. <laughs> She's a diva. Tune in next week where we'll be tooting and booting more looks on RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review. No bra, no, no panties.